Hey everybody, it's Aaron with Weekends with the Camper. Um, as you can see, I'm sitting outside. I'm actually on the golf cart. Uh, we had 65 degrees today. Last night got down to 44. Nice and warm. Starting to sound like spring every day. Even the birds are chirping. But there's one thing I haven't done yet, and that is give you a tour of the actual place that we're at. Um, we are on about a 20-acre farm. Um, my father's house is just right over there, my father-in-law's, um, the camper's right there, and it's a mess, um, if you haven't watched any of the videos, just know that this was a rush setup, uh, we moved the camper in December, moved it out here, set, just set it, literally just parked it, and, uh, didn't think we'd have to worry about it until March, April, May, you know, when we wanted to set up our, actually cam our actual campground here. But, uh, lo and behold, uh, New Year's Eve, we get an offer, New Year's Day, we take an offer, three weeks later, we're out of our house. So, in a matter of basically six, seven weeks, we had to finish moving that, all our stuff... And move out of the house so here is just a little tour of our little uh, uh, paradise away from home I'm um, here in about another month month and a half hopefully a month uh, we'll be in our new place which is actually an apartment townhouse apartment um, we're just kind of downsizing and wanting to uh, get rid of responsibilities um, and hopefully make this a lot nicer looking than that and uh, actually use the camper for what it's for camping so here I'll turn the camera around and we'll go for a drive as you can see we have a mess but let me turn the key on that's the deck our other decks back there somewhere the other part of the deck's there. That's our home right now. But we go all the way out to the road over there. Up to the tree line. the fence line there which is on the other side of the camper the gray shed and the plastic shed are both mine my little trailer and we got storage there's the other side of the camper it looks kind of gaudy but we'll fix that we go to the other side of those trees there's a billet thing back there we're planning on cleaning it up. Uh, Bella's got to race us. Oh, she saw a rabbit. But we got an old hog shed, an old barn. Uh, we got a mess to clean up, but we're working on it. So we go all the way out to that fence line there. You can see where the fields are different. Up to the fence line there. So it's about 20 acres is what we have here. Um, originally, I thought it would be kind of cool to be able to set, set the camper on top of that hill there, but there's no way of getting real power or electricity or water or power or anything like that out there. So we're settling from out back over there.
but we have a lot of projects coming up this summer involving the yard. I think my golf cart's about out of battery juice. I haven't charged it in almost a year. Still running. And Bill's got something stuck in there, probably a rabbit. But we got a couple old hog confinements. All this stuff's going to get knocked down, cleaned up. Zero percent. Better plug her in. Sorry about that. Well, we go down the hill along the fence line there. We want to set up a little hideout down there somewhere. It'll be a good spot to be able to set up archery and stuff. So this is a little tour of our little home away from home when we finally get uh, summer coming and uh, be able to start doing some dirt work. Um, right now the frost is starting to come out of the ground pretty good. Yeah, the ground is the frost is starting to come out of the ground pretty good, but. You know how uh, Mother Nature can change um, her temperament. So we're hoping to be able to very shortly uh, break some ground and start some digging and uh, get everything set up the way we need it to. Um, and hopefully we'll just be able to use the uh, camper for the summer and Winterize it and leave it sit, and this is our new way from home. Home. So, thanks for watching.